San Diegans are proud of our region's quality of life, our beaches, bays, mountains and deserts, and our clean air and water. Water is an important part of that quality of life. Animals and plants need it, and we can't do without it. On a typical day, each of us uses more than 100 gallons of water. In the San Diego area, more than 60% of fresh water is used by residents, about 13% by commercial and industrial facilities, and about 9% by agriculture. Where does all this water come from? Some water comes to us locally from a few small rivers, lakes like Lake Hodges, reservoirs, and underground wells like in San Pasqual Valley. But even in a wet year, only a quarter of our fresh water comes from local sources. In a dry year, maybe only 5%. So local water is not enough. We get most of our water from hundreds of miles away through a system of long canals from the Sacramento and Colorado rivers. These rivers are fed by our greatest water reservoir, mountain snowpack. Our scientists tell us that in San Diego, the increase of more than 4 degrees Fahrenheit by 2100 will affect our local and regional water supply. This increase in Earth's temperature is due to carbon dioxide and other heat-trapping gases released whenever we use electricity or gasoline. Heat-trapping gases act kind of like a blanket that is getting thicker because we are burning natural gas, coal and oil faster than ever. Because it's getting warmer, water in the soil, rivers and lakes will evaporate faster. Our plants and animals will need more water. Farther away, much of the snow is already turning to rain. Snow that falls will melt and that water will run off earlier and earlier in spring. Less snow will be preserved to feed the great rivers in warmer seasons. In the San Diego region, we also expect even less than our average 10 inches of rainfall a year. So what can we do? Our water agencies are already implementing new storage systems that capture more water during wet years for use in drier years. They're developing diverse and drought-proof water supplies by recycling and from desalination. Together, we too can help. If businesses, industries, and individuals all save a little water every day, we will need to import less. The more we preserve and diversify supplies, the more we can maintain the quality of life of San Diegans. Now, for our children, and for future generations.